Hey guys, Ricardo here and welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. In today's tutorial guys, I'll be showing you how to, on any Android device, how to fix the issue where your Android phone is not connecting to Wi-Fi. So this is a general tutorial on how to troubleshoot issues with Wi-Fi. So if your um, device is not connecting to a Wi-Fi network for some reason, maybe it was working before, then all of a sudden it stopped connecting, this should be able to help you to solve the issue. All right. Now to bet now to allow you to better understand how these issues work your um, problem can either be of one of two causes it's either a software issue or a hardware issue hardware is anything that's physical on the phone such as the internals and so on maybe something is broken there or software is something that has been changed on the phone such as a setting or maybe maybe a piece of software or something that you have done it's causing it not to connect now, of course, if it's software based, it can be fixed. However, if it's hardware based, it's a little bit more difficult. You would have to be able to open the phone up and um, change out a part or repair it. In some cases, you may need professional help or if you're skilled enough, you can do that yourself. Now, for today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to rule out any software issues. And chances are it's a software issue in most cases. In very few cases, it might be a hardware issue. So you should be able to fix it on your own. So let's get started with the first things you need to do in order to be able to connect to um, your Wi-Fi network or troubleshoot the issue. All right. So in case is that it's not working, the first thing I want you to check guys, is to make sure that your date and time is correct. Now, of course, you might be wondering why date and time. If date and time is wrong, sometimes the Wi-Fi will not work. So that's one of the first things you should check. So go ahead, guys. Go into um, settings. Once you're in settings, it's um, a should be under general management and of course where it says date and time for your device it might be a little bit different in my case here i have mine set to automatic date and time which is much easier but for you you might want to turn off the automatic and manually set the um the time um in 12 hour clock and of course make sure that you get the right date make sure you get the right time once you set the time and the date you should be good in some cases, that is the issue why the internet is not working in terms of Wi-Fi. And of course, once you correct the date, it should fix the problem. Also remember to reboot your device to give it a fresh start. And of course, as the first thing, so check your time and date. The next thing, guys, is to make sure that um, your internet is working properly. So you might have that different devices are connecting, but of course, your device is not connecting. Now, um, let's pretend this is your um, modem that controls the Wi-Fi. As you can see here, this is a wireless router. In the case that this is providing your internet, you're going to go ahead. And what you're going to do, guys, is that you're going to either find a power button. Most of the times you can find a power button. Go ahead and plug out the Wi-Fi router. Just simply plug it out. Wait a minute or two minutes. Then plug it back in. You're going to restart your phone as well. Sometimes what happens is that um, your phone, um, for some reason, is not playing well with the router. And all it needs is just a restart. So simply go ahead and do a restart of your router. So once you restart your router, you should be good. So just go ahead and restart your phone and your router. If that doesn't work, guys, the next thing you can do, guys, is that sometimes while you did connect your um, Wi-Fi properly, What's happening sometimes is that the network itself, the settings that you inputted, they're actually incorrect. So the phone itself used to connect fine. The password was right, but for some reason it's now wrong. So I recommend that you go in and you're going to forget the network and reconnect. Mm. All right. So simply swipe down from the top of the screen, long press the Wi-Fi. Now you're going to see my network right here. Notice I'm connected or maybe in some cases it's not connecting. It doesn't really matter as long as you're seeing the network. Go ahead, guys, and long press on the network. And notice it says forget network right there. So go ahead and um, forget network. Now notice I've been kicked off the network. What I'm doing here is just flushing out the old settings, and I'm going to connect afresh. So as you can see here, it's asking me for the password. I'm going to enter the password. Now I've re-entered the password. Um, sometimes you have a wrong password, and it's trying to connect for some reason or maybe even the password is correct but for some reason it requires that you reconnect so go ahead again and connect again i've entered the password um if you are right notice you should say i'm checking for quality internet connection make sure it says connected so in that case i've just went through 
and I've basically reconnected the internet. Sometimes just by doing that, you'll be able to fix the problem again, just by um, just forgetting network and then uh, reconnecting to the network. Next thing to do guys, in case of um, anything, go ahead again, swipe down from the top of the screen and you're gonna make sure that you're not in airplane mode. Sometimes if you're in airplane mode, what's gonna happen is that it can affect your device. So if you're in airplane mode as shown here, make sure that you exit airplane mode. So go ahead and tap on um, airplane mode to exit this. So just make sure that airplane mode is turned off and your um, everything is okay. So once you are out of your network or you have exited the mode that is flight mode. So we use this mode here called airplane mode to stop all um, internal traffic. So you turn off basically all the radios in your device. So if you're in airplane mode, make sure that you have turned it off. Mine was just on, so make sure that it's off. Once it's off, you should be good and your device should work fine. Now it's not always airplane mode. The next thing to try guys is make sure that to rule out if it's your network itself or your modem that's not playing well with your phone. Go ahead and if you have a friend, um, you're going to borrow, borrow like a neighbor's Wi-Fi just to connect for a short time. Try to connect your phone to another Wi-Fi network. If it connects to the other night, the Wi-Fi network and works fine. And then of course, when you come over back to your network, it would indicate that there's something wrong with your modem and it's not playing well with your phone. So therefore the problem is with the modem itself and not the phone as it's connecting to every other network except yours. So in that case, your um, router might need to be reconfigured. Uh, maybe it's something specific to your router that needs to be changed or has been changed lately by your ISP. And of course, it's not playing well with your phone anymore. Another thing to do, guys, is to go ahead and go into um, settings. And once you're in settings, we're going to go again down to um, to general management. We're going to go to reset. Do not worry. We're not going to reset the entire phone. We're just going to reset network settings. Sometimes the network settings has been corrupted. And of course, for some reason, it's a good idea to reset your network settings. Now, note that this will reset your Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, and other network settings to their default. So sometimes something has changed, like somebody has manually put in a change. And by going in here and resetting network settings, what you'll do is that you'll reset everything related to Wi-Fi, mobile data, and Bluetooth back to their default. So go ahead and hit reset. I'm not going to do it on this, but once you do it, it should reset everything back to the default and of course you'll have to rejoin your Wi-Fi network. This is a step up from the earlier one with just forgetting the network. By doing that also, in some cases, you should be able to fix the problem and you'll be able to connect to your um, Wi-Fi network once more. Now this method is also not bulletproof, but I'm of course going through all the possibilities, some of the most common reasons why it's not working as it should. Now of course, once you do that guys, another option, um would be so guys if all else fails i suggest that you go again and this time we're gonna um back up your device first make sure you back up all your photos all your data we're gonna do a full reset i only advise that you do this as a last resort it's no guarantee that it will work but in most cases doing a full restart should deal with almost 99 percent of all issues that's related to software not all of them totally but there are a few that might the Problem might persist after, but of course, guys, go into um, settings. You're gonna go down to general management on the setting, go to reset. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna do a factory data reset. And of course, it says reset your phone to its factory default settings. This will erase all your data, including anything that you might download, such as files and apps. So, of course, we're gonna do this particular reset here. Notice it warns you, and of course, it gives you all this. And you're gonna go down and do the reset, follow the on screen instructions to wipe your device um, totally clean. In most cases after doing that, it should fix the issue. If not, it would indicate that of course, guys, it's a more severe issue. Um, we have tried most of the things that should fix it. So in case it's still persisting after a reset, chances are guys, it's leaning more to a hardware issue. So if all of what I've said before, several um, things to try, um, I advise you next to go ahead and um, you'd need to check out what's happening with the hardware. Chances are the internal radio inside of your device has either gone bad or maybe it was faulty before. And you might be seeing issues such as the um, Wi-Fi just dropping out um, automatically, such as the Wi-Fi just turning on and off and so on. So it might be a hardware issue. In that case, um, you'd have to 
do some repairs um, if your device is under warranty I advise you not to um, struggle with it simply return it and um, basically get it replaced as it's most likely a hardware def um, defect so just go ahead guys if your device is under warranty and return it to the store and get a brand new device as most likely it's a hardware issue if not a hardware issue guys they'll probably have to if it's a repair shop they'd have to um change the board inside or the internal radius that control the wi-fi to fix the issue which is a whole lot of issue or trouble so as i said guys if your device is on a warranty i advise that you go and the route of um using the warranty as it's not worth the issue or the trouble of actually trying to change out the hardware if you understand what i'm saying unless it's absolutely necessary all right guys so i've covered almost all possibilities pertaining to this issue i know you can fix this on your um, android device no can be any android device some of these tips also work for iphone and of course guys it's ricardo garden as usual from blog tech tips and that's the quick tips showing you how you can potentially fix issues involved with the wi-fi not connecting on your device ricardo garden saying bye until next time bye guys